I make science important because I teach it every day. So that is just what we do in my classroom and the kids know just like I teach reading, I teach math every day, I teach science. So it's very important in my classroom. That helps the large part make seeds. What's this vocabulary word? What is this word, Julian? Disperse. Disperse. I definitely feel like they're using the vocabulary in a different level as well as their writing. Many ways um, <laughs> seeds can get dispersed, but animals is probably one of the most efficient ways. I mean, they're really writing like scientists and they're talking like scientists, which is amazing to me. Just to hear these little people use these words and the scientific knowledge that they have is amazing. Let's try to eat it and then it falls down. It can fall in the ground and then it can grow. So the student books are great because they always can make, there's some kind of connection to them. So not only is it a connection to science, but there's reading concepts too. So I get to teach reading like twice, <laughs> which is really cool. For heat lamps, they want to learn whenever the plants could live if their habitat got hotter. It's my classroom is noisy, but it's good noise because they're talking, they're communicating with each other. It's just, it's the best time of the day. My kids really look forward to science. The last thing I want you to do is turn and talk to your partner about one thing you learned about how animals help seeds get to new places. Turn and talk to you. I learned how animals, I mean, seeds get to new places. Okay, tell your partner thank you for listening.